started making this and I thought that I would just videotape it so you can see this really quick, easy, and really nutritious meal that I make. And it's just me, so I put some away then. I got a spoon in. So this is just ground turkey that I got at the store. And this is the kind I got. Genio ground turkey, 93% lean, all fresh, all natural, and... 21 grams of protein per serving. No artificial ingredients, no steroids, blah, blah, blah. Um, and then I'm going to add some cottage cheese, low fat cottage cheese. Um, I'll just eyeball it, but I'll show you that part when that happens. And one more ingredient, and that is a can of mushrooms. So I'll show you when I mix the cottage cheese in when this cooks. Okay, the ground turkey is almost done, and as you can see, I don't have to drain it because it's so lean. It's such low fat. You know, usually when you have to drain meat, it's because you're draining the fat that comes off it when you cook it. So I don't even have to drain it. And then I'm just putting in a can of these mushrooms here. And I turned it on low and I'm just going to let these cook in there for a little bit. And then I'll show you the cottage cheese part. Okay, I let that sit on low now with the mushrooms so that they could get warm. And for about, I don't know, five minutes maybe. And I wanted to show you too. So, you know, this has 21 grams of protein a serving. And then uh, this only has 30 calories in a serving and that is this whole can so all the mushrooms I put in there is only 30 calories and then for this low-fat cottage cheese if you can see where's the protein protein 12 grams per half cup so that's probably going to be about a serving that you're going to get when you eat this now of leftovers and I just eyeball this I don't know maybe half of it Something like that so that's how much I have left in there. And I'm going to cook this up. The cottage cheese gets warm in there. And I know it doesn't look very good, but I'll show you when it's plated. Okay, so that's it plated. I like to eat mine with ketchup, but you don't have to. And I know it may not look that appetizing, but it's really good. It's super easy recipe to get a lot of protein in. And I will show you that's just one serving. So I have a lot left then to put in the refrigerator and eat as meals for the next couple days. So just wanted to share it with you. I used to eat this all the time and somehow I forgot about it. And today I was like, wow, I miss having that meal. So I'll probably be eating this now for a lot of times coming up. So, okay, just wanted to share the recipe with you. I will see you in the next video. Bye.